One of the most disappointing stories in the Bible for me was when Esau sold his birthright for bread and stew. And for the longest time, I'd always judged him because I just couldn't imagine how he could have done that until the Holy Spirit revealed to me that the same thing Esau did was the same thing I was doing in my finances. And it may be the same thing that you are doing in your finances as well. He showed me that even though I was earning an income, I wasn't actually making money. And so I go into more details in this clip from our live Bible study sessions, which happens every single day except for Sundays between 6 to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check it out. We can laugh at Esau today. We can be like, man, how did Esau do that? Like, why would he do that? But we're doing that every single day in our lives. One practical thing that the Holy Spirit showed me a few, I think this was last year or two years ago, was when he made me realize that the fact that you are earning a salary doesn't mean that you are making money. It is what you do with the salary that determines if you are making money or not. Think about it. When you say I'm making money, make is a process of giving birth, right? To make something, it means that you are actually creating something. Earning a salary is you getting rewarded for the time that you've put in at work. But well, it doesn't mean you're making money because like Esau, he was a hunter. The day he is not able to catch an animal, he goes hungry and is in a position where his birthright can be exchanged. So a salary, if you lose your job today, what's going to happen next month? It's the same thing with Esau. If you don't catch today, you can't eat tomorrow. The fact that you are earning a salary doesn't mean that you are making money. It is what you do with the salary that determines if you make money or not. So a lot of people are eating their seeds. Your salary is a seed. It's not the harvest. Your salary is your seed. It's not the harvest. Think about the parable of the talents. The, the, the master gave the servants a seed. Go and multiply it. Tell us add that here. Your salary is not your harvest. Your salary is your seed. What you do with your seed will determine if you are making money or not. That is a mindset shift that we all need to make. That's why every time you get your paycheck, how am I investing this? What am I doing with this to ensure that it is able to give birth to more? Because that is when you know you are making money. What you are doing right now is you are earning a salary. You are, God is giving you a seed. What are you going to do with that seed? Thanks for watching. If you love this clip and you've been searching for a way to study the Bible to receive revelation and not just to gain information, I'm currently doing a live Bible study session every single day between 6 to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where I show you how you can begin to discover the things that God has hidden underneath what is written. You know, our biggest advantage today is revelation because revelation is what makes our prayers more effective. Revelation is what gives us direction. It is what empowers us to see things and opportunities that most people miss. And so definitely check it out. We're currently starting the books of Genesis. We're going to move on to the four Gospels, Acts, and then the book of Romans. I'm hoping to see you guys later today. Take care. Thanks for watching again. Bye-bye.